first we're going to take a look at how to use a division ladder to find prime factorization. Uh, but first we need to review what prime factorization actually means. So prime factorization is when you take a composite number, um, which is a number that has three or more factors, and you write it as a product of only prime numbers. And a prime number, remember, has exactly two factors. So if we took a very simple composite number, like 4, and we wrote it as a product of uh, the factor, the two prime factors of 2 times 2, then the prime factorization for 4 would be 2 times 2. Uh, you could even go as far as to look at this as an exponent value of 2 to the second power. Now let's take a look at the ladder. So we move back to our division ladder. This is probably one of the easiest ways to find the prime factorization uh, using the division ladder. So we have 84. The first thing I want to think of is the lowest prime number, which is 2. And is this number divisible by 2? So you have to recall your divisibility rules and think, does this number end in an even number, 0, 2, 4, 6, or 8. And it does end in a 4, which is an even number. Therefore, 84 divided by 2 would equal 42. Again, I need to ask. start with the lowest prime number, 2, and determine whether this number is divisible by 2, and it is. 42 divided by 2, then, is 21. I immediately recognize 21 as an odd number, and I know that it is not divisible by 2, so I'm going to move on to my next lowest prime number, which is the number 3. And I ask myself, is 21 divisible by 3? You can recall the rule that we add the digits, 2 plus 1, and if their sum is divisible by 3, then the number is divisible by 3. And 21 is divisible by 3. 21 divided by 3 is 7. Now I look at my last number, and I realize immediately that 7 is a prime number. Therefore, all of the numbers on the left side are prime numbers. And together, they will make my prime factorization using the latter method. So, 84 equals 2 times 2 times 3 times 7. And if you want to extend the learning a little bit, we could even break this down. And since we have 2 of the base number 2, we could make that in exponent, exponent form, uh, in which we take 2 to the second power times 3 times 7. And our prime factorization of 84 using the division ladder looks just like this.